If you were to ask any of Artilleron Houdin's fellow villagers, you'd surely hear them say that he looks before he leaps. After all, he did have his entire veteran pension, and he lived in a nice little place in a tidy little house, which didn't even belong to him to begin with. Not only that, he still had hair where it mattered most. Truth be told, apart from all these blessings, Houdin also enjoyed as much alcohol as he liked and managed to keep on running a secret trade with an old friend of his. And he had no intention of dying soon, since he was immortal. But it wasn't all roses to him. The shack he was given for a flexible term because of his military service was in a dire need of a renovation. Apart from that, due to the essence of his immortality, he no longer lived to drink, rather drank to live. Not to mention that things went sideways when his business partner was accused of murder. Houdin is now forced by the local authorities to find his friend and deal with him. And that, to put it mildly, is how he's dragged out of retirement.